Victory at a Starfighter, and my name is Carlin Jones, and this is a Starfighter full episode review. And today we are going to be watching season four of Ocean Girl. It has been a minute. It's been a few weeks since I've continued on with Ocean Girl season four, so a little happy that I can uh, do it tonight. So um, yeah, I mean, I feel like I have this rare ability, uh, this rare gift that I can stop watching a TV show like mid season or whatever episode for weeks, for years, and immediately I know exactly what happens like exactly where I left off. I don't need to watch any recaps or anything like that. So I'm not too worried about forgetting certain details or whatever for Ocean Girl because it's all pretty straightforward and um, I do really like these characters. Although I will say for my last watch party, some of my subscribers, Lazar and um, I forgot the other guy's name. They were talking about how, or it, maybe it wasn't Lazar. It was the other guy who was talking about how um, uh, Neri and Jason are like, the best couple i cannot wait to see that so i can shit on it <laughs> there's no way they make a good couple there is no chemistry first off if they've been together for like if they have a friendship for the last three seasons and there's clearly nothing there like clear like no chemistry no nothing wondering from like cons from the, the the consumers or fans of the show thinking like oh well what if they got together like oh they would be cute together like no one's thinking that like at all like whatsoever right if, if anything i would seem like maybe i don't even know like the the show doesn't really put that kind of energy out there in the air like that so neary and jason really doesn't go together um i don't really see anyone getting together really maybe well no i can't even say i can't even say winston and the mom getting together because the actress for the mom changed so that's like a whole new different dynamic that can't even really be dis discussed like that or even be uh, uh considered like that but um i don't know we'll see uh, well, well i can tell you what let's see if any chemistry will will uh will gather from jason and neary in this episode so we are watching season four episode five this episode is called wait for it this episode is called stranded in the desert uh <clears throat> yeah should be a good one um i'm, I'm sure because there's, there's a lot going on there's like x files uh, FBI agents going on and then some type of dig site crew from Africa or excuse me Egypt which which is in Africa but uh, so yeah there's a lot going on so let's get into it I'm going to start this episode in five four three two one Oop, second delay <clears throat> Ooh, miss this music Miss Ocean Girl music. I need to get the whole soundtrack. Like I just need it. I only have a few songs on my on my uh, on my phone. I doubt it. There hasn't even been any chemistry between Neri and 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 Jason in this season thus far, so I don't understand how they're going to make that correlation. Clearly. I do really like that the show has um, took this turn, right? Because the first season was very fun in in sense of like there's nothing serious going on, there's like not much really drama, um, not much heartbreak or anything. Just near you having fun with our powers and a fish out of water type thing. Season two is where it gets a little bit more serious, and we see uh, characters really get more developed, and you see characters cry, and, and a lot of heartwarming stuff. 
And in season three, you really dive into the lore of Ocean Girl. Where is she from? How how does her powers work? Her people, her the galaxy, the universe, all this stuff, right? And now season four is really diving into not just the history of her people, but the history of the entire world and how her people, like you know, her people have a huge part in our in our uh, Earth's history. I really like that. So why do they want it again? Is it like for riches or something? Or I guess just for the technology? Wow, that's their dad. Yeah. Yeah, they need help. Because, honestly, I don't think they can go back home. Neri, I have a feeling you'll find it if you get out of the water. Long enough, she's already dripping wet. See, I don't understand how people can think that there's going to be like a romantic chemistry between the two when clearly Jason is very protective over Neri to the point where it's sickening. <laughs> All right, where are we? Like, where in the desert? sir we're dealing aliens they're gonna do stuff we, we're not even anticipating for now is if we just solve this problem and then Neri has to leave the planet like she has to excuse me
bro, take your pants off. Take your pants and your shirt off. You're gonna die in that heat. Is that actual person? <laughs> I thought it was like a mirage. Get you out where? Yeah, why? What? So you're not letting us go because of religious reasons? Man, we don't knock this dude out and just steal his car. trust you for now but no uh. true She can't do that. No, well, maybe she can. <clears throat> I wonder what it would be like to live in Orca. It'd be kind of weird. I would just be afraid that the. Well, it has to be safe, right? Hey, don't touch me. I can't believe he, he touched him like that. He could have got decked in the face.
Hmm. None of your business, kid. This little kid. Snitches get stitches. Hmm. <laughs> True. But we should leave like, like really like early morning. What is that? Whoa! It's that, uh, it's that symbol. That makes you think you're going to be able to question her. They're going to take her and you're never going to see her again. It's definitely not yours. What a square. <laughs> nah. Thanks for informing us. Hmm. <laughs> He's like, I don't know. this guy hmm 
Maybe. They could be boosting it, though. Well, I mean, well, no. Maybe it's the energy that's making them recharge or whatever, but then. Yeah, see, he's going to have to go back in. Yeah, well, Jason wouldn't know that. Other people are, like, you know, tapping, tapping his little line. Oh, God. Now we're going to have to fight our way out. Exactly. Let's get out of here. Well, we can't outrun them in a car. Well, I'm not scared anyway, because Neri can definitely take these two on, or take those three on by herself, hand to hand combat. Ah. Well, he's. Oh, don't tell me they're going to steal the car. He should have the keys on him. What is he laughing at? It's weird. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> Jason's like, oh god, it's dad. Yeah, that's a little weird. Wait, they're going to want that, though. The agents? Well, as long as he doesn't tell them. <laughs> I don't fly, I swim. <laughs> that's the best quote. That's what that's definitely a top five Neary quote. Hmm. 
Hmm. Interesting episode. Hmm. Interesting. All right, well, that's the episode. Um, yeah, interesting episode. Um, the one thing that we did learn in this episode, though, is that there's been folk tales or, you know, kind of like a fables fables told about Neri's ancestors and when they used to roam here on Earth. Um, very interesting. Um, but I wonder, like, what ancestors, like, I wonder if they were, like, are they like ancestors like are they actually related to neri because i'm sure not everyone in orca is like related right but um very interesting to 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 see what's going to happen next and there has been no chemistry between jason and neri so i don't care what anyone says between that there's nothing happening if anything he's still controlling as ever and it's very alarming to start a relationship with anybody he's very controlling so um so yeah very cool episode we're gonna have to watch the next one obviously uh, so yeah that has been the episode review please let me know in the comments what you thought about this episode did you like it did you hate it um yeah and i will see you on the next one but until then victory or death star fighters victory or death <laughs>